And now we've got to think about putting a background on. Now, you'll see I've already started it. Let me show you the original picture again. This has got a very similar background, as you can see. This is a little bluer, but uh, I think the grey is fine. So let me show you how I did that. I started off with the white, as you can see. I'm turning it upside down because it's easier for me. So let's continue that. You've got to go right up into the hair and we'll have to bring that back later. Now I'll just go as far as there. This has got to be a pretty solid white. Like that, and then rub it in. And on the edges, the usual thing, clean your colour shape up before we do this. So. There you go. And just push that into the hair. Like that. Okay. Now on top of that, we put the blue. It doesn't really matter whether you put the blue on first or second, but um, it, well, no, it really doesn't matter because, because we're going to do it again anyway. And there's a grey. So it's the blue and the grey. And together, you'll make that up. That colour up. Well, almost, because you can see there's a little pink in here. Well, that's this colour. Now, we haven't used it. Well, I did use it just in the mouth, just a touch. But it's nowhere else. But this colour can also be put in. Again, be tentative to start with. Because we can put two coats on. And blend it and then you can see how that's working out it's a little lighter so it means we've got to darken it well I mean it could be that you like it like that I actually prefer it slightly darker than that so this time I'm going to put the blue on and then the grey on again to give me a little more strength The more times you do this, the stronger the base colour will be. Now, I'll leave this one for the moment, if we can put it in afterwards. Now that's, that's got that just about right. Colour shaper, pushing it in. I think I'll give it another, another layer of the grey just to make sure. And this has got to come all over. So why am I doing it now and not once I finish the picture? Well, I wanted to see how the hair reacted to the background. And it was all one colour. Now that's worked very well. You see this colour here. Now this is what we want to put in over here now. So bit on that. There you go. Now that is lovely. So that, to all intents and purposes, is finished now. I think we'll, um, we'll leave it at that. But it looks good.